Okay, quick question. You know, speaking, uh, asking, asking as a person of color to another person of color. Why do our lives matter? Because we're niggers. Uh, come on. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. You know why our lives matter. No, I don't. Don't play stupid. No, I'm not playing stupid. Why? Why? Like, they don't. They never answer that question. Because it, we're fucking being murdered and that racism and so white that that's not that doesn't answer why do our lives matter because if we go by the if, human if, being. if we go by it well if we go by the biblical by biblical law by divine law because of original sin we are all deserving of death so technically by by bible standards no lives matter if god wanted to right now he could smite us and that would be it but you know what the meaning all black lives matter means it's not explained because You're it's going to be so philosophical and fucking deep with it it's not that deep why not because it's like because it, it, it you know it gets black lives matter gets pushed um but uh, gets gets you know I guess misconstrued or whatever as it being a supremacy movement like okay we matter because we're better than whites oh, oh. says who and how so no one fucking said they're better than white or 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 or, or that whites or, are better but i mean like look as a hispanic if i was to get shot today my face ain't ending up on a shirt it probably wouldn't even make it on the news that's so sad. So if so, your fucking brother, who is a person of color, gets fucking incarcerated or lock, locked up, his life doesn't matter, right? Is, that's uh, well, te- well, technically, no lives matter. If you think about it, in, in the whole so scope of things. Like, no I, lives matter? Well, I mean, do you have the cure for cancer? Mm, yeah. yeah what, what's the cure? Uh, acknowledging that lives matter. That's not the cure for cancer. I'm talking about the actual cancer. Like, let's say, let's say, you know, veganism. What? Veganism. Okay, but let's say, let's say I had butt cancer right now. Do you have the cure to get rid of the the cancer in my ass in my assholes right now? Yes. Um. Yes. Yeah, getting some good. <laughs> Some good dick. In your How's that? <sighs> okay, I'm just, I'm just trolling. Why, um, why are you trolling? Why are you trolling? You're, you, look, you're trying to deflect from the real. I'm not movie. deflecting anything. I'm just, I like, I, I just want to know why is it that that costed that cost a lot of these cities to be burnt to the ground, and 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 Christopher Dorn who was black to be murdered while people were looting. Why, why is it? What, what justified that for, for people are fucking upset with the system, not giving justice to black people. So they've been peacefully protesting for fucking ages now. Mm -hmm. What do you fucking expect when Countless black people in a row, countless being fucking murdered and not giving justice. They're going to be fucking mad. They're going to loot and they're going to fuck shit up. Okay, what about that is so, so fucking hard to comprehend. So, but but what what gives them the right to do that? Like what? Like There's, because they're not they're not they're not going after whitey. They're not the right. they're not going fuck after whitey. Rights. At this point, right? People don't give a fuck about rights. Okay, well people then, the system. Well then, then then no lives matter because no one has a right to live. Because it's like okay, if someone's coming at me, I'm not going to be like, oh well, he's black. I should not be able to defend myself because they're an endangered species. Apparently, <laughs> I mean it's. Do you believe in white supremacy and racism? Um, honestly, the only time I've ever experienced racism was growing up in New York City by black people. Define racism. Uh, being marginalized because I spoke another language, being attacked, uh, being told to go back to Mexico even though I'm not Mexican, um, called a spick. 
uh, that's not what racism jumped. is. Okay, that is, that, is, that is the Webster's de- that is the Webster's definition of racism. If you want to go by the uh, Paul Mooney definition of racism, uh, because fuck you know, him. okay, <laughs> why fuck Paul Mooney? <laughs> Do you know who no, Paul Mooney is? is. Who, who the fuck is that? He's a black comedian for fuck's sake. Holy fuckaroni. Woman. Yeah. Woman. Fuck him. Why? What is systemic? I feel like you need to educate yourself on systemic. Systemic. Racism, okay, well. The, the, slavery and its effect. Long lasting effects. Okay. On have you picked cotton? What was that? Have you, have you picked? Have you been forced to pick cotton? Um, no, but my fucking ancestors have. Okay. And well then, well then, thank them, thank them for the free rent. I mean, I mean, what? It, it's like you know, what about what about what about the millions that's of that's white people? Thing, I think. What about the millions of white people that died to to? Mind. What about the millions of white people that died to abolish slavery in the Civil War? Do their lives matter? Oh my God! No one is saying that. Okay, all well then, because don't matter. because However, you get because it's like slavery is used to justify, and and that's not even the point I'm trying to make. But we diverted. But okay, like if we're gonna go with that, like you can't you can't constantly be using that. If not, I could probably just use okay, um, like like in the 40s and the 50s, uh, the United States sterilized uh, a lot of my ancestors or I could still be pissed off at Spain for killing off the indigenous uh, Taino Indians on the island of Puerto Rico. Those so are my ancestors. Just kind of shut the fuck up and let the system continue to not serve justice to <laughs> The murders. Well, I'm, I'm just talking about, like, people. but the thing is, when it comes, well, if we're going to talk about Michael Brown, um, Breonna Taylor. Oh, you mean, you mean when she was dating a, a drug dealer and who pulled the gun? I mean, it, it was a so tragedy. It was actually proven that it was a tragedy on all sides. Like it wasn't, it wasn't a, it wasn't an execution. It was a fuck up on a 360 okay. degree fuck up. And this is in, okay. So if you murdered someone by accident, you fucked up, you shot someone. Should you Does go to it mean, jail? Th- no. No, because it was an accident, right? Of course not. Yeah. I mean, hell, you know, it, it's like, you know, sue them. <laughs> You get money, you sue him. It's like wrongful death. All right. He's fucking dead. You can't buy a life back. Yeah, well, I mean, you do don't, hear don't, yourself. Don't like, don't date don't date drug dealers. There we go. <laughs> Problem solved. <laughs> I mean, I just you can't be that stupid. You're I'm a not, smart man. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not being it. stupid. It's just like look, it's a case by case basis. Michael Brown. It was not hands up, don't shoot. The coroner proved that. Um, George Floyd, he wasn't choked out. He had a, an overdose. The coroner proved that. In fact, the body the body camera showed that they did everything to try to get him in the car to calm him down. Like, brother, you're fine. You're fine, brother. Don't, don't, you know, nothing's going to happen to you. He fought. He ended up, you know, he ended up catching a heart attack. I and, think... It would just take that was one of that would family members to be fucking yeah, and no one will give a shit. I, I of course I would give a shit, but if I'm like, hey, help me, like fuck you, Smick, I'm like, oh, well, I guess fuck me, Smick. You know, it's like we, 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 no one would give a shit. If no one would give a shit. Was locked up. No one would give a shit. No, you wouldn't give a shit because you don't know me. Uh, uh, Bippo Bippo Jenkins so across the street wouldn't give a don't shit. Know Joyce- George Floyd, we shouldn't give a fuck about. I'm not murder. saying that. I'm saying that if we're gonna, if we're gonna be, if we're gonna start a revolution behind certain people, hey, how's about we get all the facts before we start burning the shit down? He was not murdered. He caught an overdose and he caught a heart attack it because he was on drugs. It, it does matter. Why? It does matter. Did you see the video? Of yes, I did see the video, and I saw the body cam footage where they tried to calm him down. Did you see the body cam footage that was re- uh, released over the summer? No, no, you just saw him lying on the ground and people people assuming that he was choked out. 
Like, so, okay, question. Mm -hmm. Do you think this shit is being manipulated? Yes. There are people that say that Black Lives Matter was created to kind of, I don't know, stir the pot. I mean, they, they, you, it's called, it's called, uh, willing, uh, willing idiots, willful idiots. Are you woke? What? Are you woke? Oh, please. Let's not, let's not use that silly social justice warrior. Is your third eye open? What, my brown eye? I just took a shit. Your third eye. What? Oh, oh, we're, we're going to go with the. The whole uh, new age shit. The new world order. Yes, I know about the new world order. Yes. What do you know about the new world order? It was born on September 11th, <laughs> which was right. which was a Masonic ritual. Actually, no. Before that. Well, yeah, but it was the it was a Mason. Uh, 9/11 was a Masonic ritual. In fact, the twin towers were when they were hit. It was like a tuning fork. And where did you get this information? This, <laughs> I do oh, my own research. I do my own research. I know Look at about this, shit this. In plain sight, mm -hmm. the truth is hidden in plain sight. Okay. Well, I'm, my question is, my All question of this is shit why? Is what? By design. Okay. Yes. So it, this 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 whole fake race baiting. So why are you fucking questioning the people? Oh, why are you so fucking? I didn't say that. No, I'm asking what, why do you feel personally that your life matters? Because I mean, look, I'm being fair. It's like, it's like me. I feel if I was to get shot tomorrow by a cop, it wouldn't really matter. I mean, the only thing that will happen is somebody else will be able to get a job. Somebody else will be able to move into my apartment because what about your family. I, I won't be alive to fucking, fucking know. Die. What about your family? Does their it, family I wouldn't be alive to fucking care because, like it says in the Bible, once you die, your thoughts cease. It's, and you believe in the Bible, don't you? Yes, of course. That's why you're so fucking stupid. How am I I'm stupid? Sorry. I'm sorry. Why are you, um, why are you high? Probably, yeah, I'm high yeah. on life. No, bullshit. So. <laughs> I've never done weed before. I'm a weed well, virgin. Okay, well, I didn't say weed. He's <laughs> probably got some yeah, other I'm, substance running yeah, up I'm and through. Of like, what? I don't know. You okay like, there? Uh, Who hurt you? Stupidity. Who hurt you? Who hurt me? Yeah. Asshole, ignorant motherfuckers like you hurt me. How have I hurt you, sweetheart? You're ignorant. I haven't called you not one negative word. You're the one that said the N word. I'm no, like, come it's like on. Your ignorance makes me sad, or your lack of empathy. It's not the lack of empathy. Like it's it's empathy it's like if you really look at the big picture, who gives a fuck? Right. So you're just saying no one lives matter. Who exactly. No lives matter. No one is better than anyone. No one is lesser than anyone. I feel like the one the one con people. the constant thing is death. Whites, blacks, Hispanics, Asians, Jews, Gentile, uh, Muslims, we all die. We all become worm food. Right. It doesn't matter. So do you, you think people are feeding too in too much into everything? I want a actual good argument on why uh, you know why? Why? What's the fight for? Why? Like, mm -hmm. why are you so worried about this? Like, it's like it, you know the 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 lies that happen within these stories, within these cases. That there's like we're gonna we're gonna politicize this. We're gonna. But then when when somebody says, "Wait a minute, this is what actually happened," racist. I mean, and when you really think about it, there's no such thing as race because I can make a baby with you. I can make a baby with right. a white person. This we're the human race. Yeah. We all bleed blood. Like we honestly, so so it's like this. This to me, this is all fucking silly. 
and yeah. and honestly, and it's like, oh, white supremacy, white supremacy. I've never seen a, a person within the KKK in real life. You know, on here, I've been called the N word more times so by sad, by little white kids, but I've been jumped many times by black kids. But if I freaking say that, you're a racist, even though according to their, their definition, black people. Well, what are your thoughts on black people as a whole? Some of them are pretty sexy and I want to marry them. So, um, no, because you sound like you have like some underlying hate for black people, black men in particular. Well, I'm straight, I, I'm not into men. No, I mean, like, <laughs> like someone like bullied you, like, or made you feel like you weren't a part of the black community. Well, you sound either. like white people have bullied you and you have some underlying hate towards them. Right. No, yeah. it just sounds like And it sounds like it sounds like white people have hurt you and and you feel like you need to take them down because they bullied you and they made you feel less than and I'm sorry for that. So so you don't believe in white supremacy, like you don't believe in I believe I believe people I believe people can be biased towards other people and treat them mistreat them. But the thing is when you really look at the numbers, it, it's like you know do I believe that the KKK exists yes of course I do do I think that they are someone to be feared and worried about absolutely not right because they're more of us than them and if they try anything <laughs> goodbye enough right so <laughs> I mean it's I think that Stay but weird. but but you know going around and busting up your own neighborhoods and and killing Christopher Dorn who who was a black police officer for protecting protecting his friend's business or you know um or what was his name I keep forgetting his name I re- I remember they called him Black Rambo he was in in California. Black Panther. No, no, no. He was black. He, he was called the Black Rambo. He was uh, Christopher something. Ah, it's gonna, uh, it's gonna. I'm gonna remember it when you're gone. But uh, right. But you know, he he in his manifesto because he was going, going. He was actually going after people, corrupt people within the 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 sheriff's department. Um, I forgot his name. But I agreed with a lot of what he wrote in his manifesto. He was a black man. And they ended up killing him. But I mean, look. Like it's, it's like why? Like who like what? Why does your life matter? Like just why? Yeah. Like why? Like what? What? Like if 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 black people were to leave the earth, like all disappear, what are we losing? And and for that matter, if all white people left, what are we losing? If all Latinos left, what are we losing? Okay. We probably gain a better environment because you know these people aren't farting and shitting. <laughs> it's like, what are we? What are we? What are we losing? Right. I mean, well, you give your life matter or purpose. You're the one who, <laughs> like, who gives you, what gives you purpose in life to live? I'm just taking up space. Do you have, what, what is your purpose I'm, in life? I don't, I have no purpose. I'm just taking up space. I'm here, you know, hey, come, you come kill no me. Sense of purpose. Like, come kill and me. That's your personal. Purpose. So, no, no, but, no, but come on. What are we, like, what are we losing? If all black lives were were to go, what are we losing? What are we gaining? Like what, like what is the cost cost analysis? What 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 what's gonna happen? It, like if we lost the sperm whales, what's gonna it's gonna fuck up the ecosystem? I mean, <laughs> I mean if we lose if we lose without black people, I mean we already got rock. We already got rap. <laughs> we got. Everybody. We got ma- we got that we got mathematics already. I mean, we're we're pretty much good. Invented ninety percent, if not more, of the shit in the world. Okay, well, if they were, they'll it'll still be here if they go. <laughs> it's like, 
Yeah. I mean, what what do we what would we lose? I mean, I could I could live in the world without the baby. Yeah, but I could live. I could live in the world without freaking Snoop. <laughs> I'd be fine. <laughs> I'd be like, you know what? Yeah. But you couldn't live without Donald Trump or like. I can. I can. Your white savior. I can. I can live without them. I'd be fine. Yeah, well, that's your person. I, I would be fine. I'd be fine. I'd, in fact, hell, if, if Ricky Martin and J Lo were to leave, I'd be like, yeah, all right. Fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. Fuck them. <laughs> Who gives a shit? But that's you, though. Yeah. That's your feeling. But you're not it's answering. Your what feeling. do you. Not act- everyone thinks like you. Yeah, and that's sad. Because every because then we would live in the world of peace because it would be like, why do I hate this person? What's the point? Why do I love this person? What's the point? You will actually have to think about it. You will actually have to have a real reason to hate or love a person. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> you- I mean, my way of thinking gets rid of it, racism because it, it just. But see, not everyone has their way of thinking. And that's sad. Yeah, that's a re- sad reality you have to Like, because I think I'm falling in love with you and Don't most- fall in love with me Because I don't like you Oh, okay well. Not yet, at least I have to Oh, okay Well, yeah, fine Whatever No, I Ouch Alright, whatever I All think right. you're interesting I think your point of view On the world is interesting It's realistic yeah, like it's realistic. It, it's it's time. more of a big we picture. We wouldn't give a fuck about anything. But then, yeah, well, we then you know, like, anything. like imagine who would give a fuck if Mary Jane in the movies is black now? I don't give a fuck. Right, Zendaya was fantastic. I like to see it as we're all human. We're the human race. Yeah, stop fucking dividing. Yeah, well, and and don't you think Black Lives Matter is a divi- is dividing is being divisive? It is divide. I think I do think it's divisive. Because honestly, I don't feel welcomed. Yeah, I'm I'm told I'm not needed. Uh, well, until until the next person gets shot, and then it was like, we need to form up and march in the streets and break windows and shit. And I'm like, nah, man, I I, I want to watch some you know reruns of Stargate SG One on Amazon. You know, it's yeah. like fuck that. <laughs> like honestly, I got to go to work in the morning. I got shit to do. <laughs> I got more important shit to do than 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 worry about some crackhead catching a fucking uh, overdose. You know, and him spazzing out like I'm gonna get killed. I'm like, well, no, you you killed yourself, brother. Yeah. Like you know, it's don't do the drugs. I mean, be careful who you hang with. I mean, you don't see me hanging out with drug dealers, prostitutes, gang members, white supremacists, uh, you know, um, Mormons. You know, you don't see me hanging out with those crackheads. No. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like I'm not, I don't, I don't run with the fucking uh, Latin Kings. They're crackheads. I don't want to deal with them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, all of this shit is set up by design to divide the world. Mm-hmm. They want chaos. They want us to hate everyone. Yeah. They don't want humanity. They want us at war. They want a race war. Yeah, well, yeah. why? You look in the media. What are they promoting? Yeah. Sex, uh, money, gr- drugs. Well, there's nothing wrong with sex. I mean, you know. I mean, there isn't, but like. I mean, you know, people go nuts with yeah, it. I mean, I, 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 I have a thing against the polyamory, but that's because, you know, I like to focus on one person. Yeah. I don't. I don't got time. Too, I don't. I'm I don't. Very selfish. I don't got time to like be Indeed. cheating and shit. And yeah. Yeah. I'm a very passionate, passionate man. What's your sign? Oh, you're gonna get scared off. I feel like you're like a. 
I'm gonna be I'm gonna be shocked. Leo or something. Close. Like a like a Virgo. Yep. I knew it. Well no no you didn't. You guessed Leo first. <laughs> yeah. You you give me Virgo. Mm-hmm. And that's not a bad thing. Yes, we're very analytical yeah, people, but we're also very yeah. solitary people. <laughs> yeah. I like your your way of thinking. Like it's interesting. Um yeah. So, so, mar- so you want to marry me? Yeah, I want to have all your babies. Oh, just two. <laughs> we can have fur babies. Fur babies. Those are better than real ones. Oh, you don't want to. You don't want to make more of you. No. Oh. I want to. I want to know what want, our you want real babies. I want to know what our kids would look like. <laughs> Dark as hell. Yeah, man. They don't, okay, we could save a lot. We'll save a lot child. of money on sunscreen. <laughs> yeah, if you had a dark skinned child who experienced colorism or racism, I'm Puerto, I'm Puerto Rican. My color grandmother color. experienced colorism. <laughs> Never been told, oh, you're fucking dark. I don't like you. No, because I, I, I just, I, the has, way, the way I, the way I see it in the summer, I just turn into a more delicious shade of brown. Yeah, but what about your sister? Women have it harder. I don't have the a sister. The and brighter you are, the more sexually attractive you are, or attractive you are. Oh, well, that's not how I was raised. What about your sister? I don't have so a sister. All, all you think, you're just thinking about your feelings. I have a, I have a god sister who, who's black. Yeah, and I bet she experienced colorism. Yeah, from other black people. Yeah, from other black people. It's silly. Right. Hmm. This shit is in our own community, in the own fucking. Well, I, I can't fix that. I mean, I, I'm hitting on you, and and you're you you know you you're, you're freaking curving my ass. <laughs> this was fun. Really? I just want you to fucking. Take your head out of your ass. My, my head is out of my ass. I actually see 360 degrees. It's just I'm squinting while everyone is like, you know, just looking around. I'm just like, hmm. Yeah, it's a very. Hmm. Yeah, it's a lot of shit going on. Yeah, and well, there's a lot of stat. Up. There's a lot of static, and I'm just like peeling. Hmm. Yeah, you, and you're not the only one who feels that way. Yeah, good. We should or we should start a we should start a gang. Take over. Yeah. Take over the take over the world. Yeah, like the zombie slayers. Oh, okay. Yeah, everyone no. like a brain dead dot zombie feeding into like No, we'll just go into we'll just go into Cheyenne Mountain. We'll just take the hottest people, go into Cheyenne Mountain, and just you know wait for everyone to like take each other out, and then we come out. What's your ethnicity? I'm Latino. Like what country? Well, I've been said it like three times. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Yes. Yeah. New Yorkian, to be exact. Yeah. Yeah. So you're like. Probably biracial, right? No, I'm pretty straight. No, biracial. <laughs> uh, oh, you mean, okay, I see your joke. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, you, you know, I, I'm a I'm a hybrid. I got white and black in me, and and Indian and Native Indian in me. So. Yeah. And I did, I did a, I actually did a race, uh, uh, how racist are you test by, uh, the, by this, uh, Canadian, uh, news magazine. And it showed that I actually have zero, <laughs> zero fucking, uh, uh, loyalty to any race. <laughs> yeah. Do you, are you like a podcaster? Yes. What's your, uh, your link or whatever. All right, you could find this every everywhere because I've been doing it for over fifteen years. 
And what do you talk about in your podcast? Um, what kind of topics? Uh, you know, mostly politics, and you know, I tell jokes. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, I interview Trump for Biden. <laughs> Trump. <laughs> yeah, the right answer is neither. Well, candidate. look, I you know, Trump was never my first choice. I was mm-hmm. always a. I'm a libertarian. I, you know, I was, um, a Ron Paul guy and, Mm. you know, what, 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 no, I said, yeah, yeah, Yeah. you know, I, and, and when he, and when he wasn't on the ballot, I voted for Cynthia McKinney who ran in the green party, who, uh, who I met personally, who I love, who was a black woman. I voted for her. Yeah. You never heard of Cynthia McKinney? No one's heard of Cynthia McKinney. I keep saying, I voted for Cynthia McKinney. Like, who the fuck is Cynthia McKinney? Yeah. I love the fuck out of Cynthia McKinney. <laughs> yeah, I will check out your podcast. Yeah. Um. You sure? <laughs> 